Good morning. We are extremely pleased that you are here. It is good to come together for the purpose of co-creating. Do you agree? Yes. Hmm. You like taking thought beyond that which it has been before? Is that what brings you? You want to be part of the leading edge conversation? Expansion of the universe? You come to come into alignment with who you are <sighs> that's the way we see it that's the greatest advantage of something like this because you have already sifted through the contrast of your life experience so you have already identified an expanded version of you sometimes you don't know it because you do not realize that you are vibrational beings you're so accustomed to seeing yourself in your physicality that you forget about your vibrational nature. And so most humans move around in their physical world, which is in fact a translation of vibration. But you are so good at this translation, you are so good at your physical perceiving that sometimes your physical awarenesses override your ability to deliberately create vibrationally. And what we mean by that is you are such good observers, perceivers, awarenessers of your reality that you observe something and because you do, you offer a vibration about it. And because you offer a vibration about it, you offer a transmission that law of attraction is responding to and then what you observed which radiates out from you vibrationally comes back to you vibrationally and you translate it into life experience and then it feels to you like life is happening to you it doesn't feel to you sometimes that you are calling it to you with your offering your vibrational offering and that's only because you're not offering on purpose not all the time not most of the time hardly ever <laughs> well you mean to and it's a lovely thing isn't it when there is something that you can give your attention to that is just wonderful to see when you see it especially after you focus on it for a while you just feel better and better and better it's like it breathes life into you and as you give your attention to this life-giving thing then it sometimes feels to you that there should be more life-giving things around. Give me the life-giving things and take away the things that bother me and then I will live happily ever after. And we say, as a sort of conditional love you are wanting, isn't it? Change the conditions to things that I prefer and then I will observe them and then I will be really happy. And then Abraham, then, I'll be on that role. Well, I'll observe something good and something good will radiate from me and then the universe will give me something else good and off I'll go. And we say, yeah, let's do that. We've enjoyed this interaction immensely. <laughs> That's all we've got. <laughs>